Hi, my name's Mani Kerridge. I'm part of the Victorian Deaf Cricket Team. So I'm also playing for MDCC, Melbourne Deaf Cricket Club. That, and I'm also president of the club as well. Well, deaf cricket really, all the players are deaf. That's the obvious difference. But deaf cricket is really about people, community, culture, being together as one and understanding each other. We feel safe, we feel on equal terms because we're all deaf. And a group of deaf people that understand how to communicate with each other, how to learn to play the game together, how to celebrate our achievements together and respect for each other and our cultural identity and having a disability background. I'm the Victorian captain for the deaf this year or maybe next year, who knows when the NCIC will be on. It's really exciting to have the Victorian team and be the captain of the Victorian team. So I know there's a lot of young Victorian team players. It would be a great opportunity for those players to be able to get involved in um, state squads and then they can actually step up and hopefully be able to put their hand up for the Australian team. Hi, I'm Lachlan McRae and I am the Victorian ID captain. With COVID, um, there was a real um, spanner in the works. We weren't able to, you know, be as a team. Um, it um, yeah, really disappointed all of us and now we're back together, um, which is really good. With this um, camp that we're doing at the moment for the two day, um, today and Sunday, which is really good for some of the young players to come forward and showcase what they've got and potentially going into, you know, going to um, Australia as well, which is really good for them. I'm John Lonigan, the Australian coach for players with an intellectual disability here in Victoria, working through our selection process to pick an Australian squad to play against England in June. The tournament is going to be a combination of five 2020s and three one days. So it's allocated based on a point system of win, lose, draw, etc. Uh, but the opportunity is absolutely fantastic for, for our players and for the England players as well to actually represent their country as part of a pathway as uh, something that they you know, may not have had a chance to do previously um, based on their support and their work at home, etc. not being able to push themselves. So now they're in a high performance environment playing cricket and being the best cricketers and people they can be. So it's, yeah, it's a magnificent opportunity for everyone involved. Hi, this is Stuart Stockdale. I'm the uh, chairman of Taverners in Victoria. Our prime focus is supporting cricket charities uh, and All Abilities is our cornerstone partner in the charity work we do. The, the major focus on our, our support of All Abilities is uh, on a national front when we support the All Abilities National Cricket Carnival and all the branches of Taverners around Australia will contribute and we're going to put up $100,000 to assist with the running of that tournament and we're going to do that in partnership with Cricket Australia.